key to completing extinction will depend on gigas and since the complete crew has been here it's been our top priority as it stands we've got a few low level ones back at base to get us started but they're certainly not strong enough to take on another wild giga by themselves and they're not fit to take on the higher tier orbital supply drops we begin today's adventure with myself tribe mate romeo and shizella taming a level 70 giga I construct a taming pen and check out my Giga taming guide if you want to know more about this design where I fully explain it in detail there. I'll leave a link at the top. The beauty of this trap is it's easy and cheap to construct and the Giga can approach it from any angle. In theory. <laughs> <laughs> he wants nice. nothing to do with our shenanigans. He's acting stuck but I don't trust it. Yeah, I don't trust that that's not... <laughs> it's corrupted or mad at our trap. Mm -hmm. I mean, what aren't they mad at? He's completely frozen. Oh, corrupted Rex. We're standing quite far back because if he decides he's not glitched, yeah, I'll, no, yeah. his face. I'll just stop <laughs> shooting him for a second. About. Like, while you do it, I think you should be good, mate, because he's not been able to bite. Oh, uh, if you want to keep shooting, I'll be able to stay goes. How many gates do you need? I uh, don't know at the minute, Chunk, because uh, Romeo has. I've got five. He's put some stuff down, and that might be enough, actually. I love how James went to so much effort to get this nice yeah, trap down. Up, yeah. And it's oh, nice. He's out. <clears throat> he didn't even move. Nice. Here he is. 16 melee, 17 weight, 11 mm -hmm. stam, 18 in, in oxygen, 16 health. I mean, that's still better than what we've still got. Better. It is, yep. it is. When out in the Forbidden Zone, which is frequented by corrupted creatures and an unfavorable heat, sometimes the wasteland is impacted by meteor showers. Myself and tribe mate Romeo are caught out in one of these storms, and as we come across the best Giga we've seen yet, a level 95. It leaves us with little option but to abandon our task and seek refuge in the shelter of one of the domes. Because of these meteor impacts, building out in the Forbidden Zone would be pretty futile, and being in the short radius of a meteor impact will soon destroy a player and a team. But when it does come for looking for high-level dinos, including Gigas, it always can be a challenge. This level 95 Giga is probably not good enough to beat any of the bosses on this map, but a fully imprinted one might be good enough to take on a wild Giga solo. Oh, that was another Giga that just spawned in front of us. Did you see that? No. There's another level 5 Giga. Okay. Oh, great. Great, great. Okay. Should I go and get my Giga out and take care of it? Should we should? Uh, okay. If you want Knock. to, I can continue shooting this one. Or do you think it's best to keep shooting? If we don't want it coming over here, it's going to cause no, trouble, isn't it? No, we don't it? want <laughs> I, got, I, got, I can carry on shooting. So if you want to... I think mine's powerful yeah, enough to take on arm now. I've got a handful of train carts on me, I can help shoot. Nice. Yeah, it's too close. Yeah. Tell you, it's a good spot. <laughs> mm -hmm. I literally just spawned, I just watched it coming. Oh god. Hey, we're slowly improving these guys. Yeah. Surely, but surely. Well, this one's almost about about uh, biting for four digits, like nine, two, three each bite. So it's about halfway down on its thing. It's the problem is if is if something else comes and gets him involved and it eats something here. I did not bring any products. I've got plenty on there. <coughs> I got I have, some. I have a handful left from the six cheer up there, shows. Thank you. Jesus, I might not have enough. Do you need a hand? Uh, I think I do, mate. I think this is going to get me. 
yeah, it's gonna get me. I'm only at 20, 20k left. If it eats me, it's probably gonna come towards you. Quick, you need to run, run. Quick. Run, run, run. I'm trying. Get out of the way. It'll probably kill me because I bleed. But as long as I don't die next to it. Oh, oh my man. word. Kill it. You're so that, uh, I just want to say how close. Health. 32 health left. <laughs> 32 health left. No, no, I'll get killed. Oh, dear. Gee. Uh, I'm going to pop this up quick. Just... Oh, that's funny. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Uh, 32 health left. Oh, no, now Paradon. Uh, get the call. So, um, staying on my giga for a bit. Hey guys, a good job. To throw out my snow owl and try and heal that giga up a bit. <laughs> Alright, uh, there's 316 marks on it. That was just what I had in my hand. I do have some up in transmitter as well. I've got some. That, that'd be enough, wouldn't it? I don't know. Yeah. Let's take some more. We go. Yeah. One so we lost fifty percent. Or it's one thirty-five instead of one eighty-five. Okay. Oh, really? Twenty-three points in melee. Mm -hmm. Eighteen in health. Not that that makes much difference really at all. <laughs> the journey to find the perfect Giga continues, and on extinction, the complete crew have now acquired some tames that can tackle low to mid-tier drops. The element vein works very similar to the orbital supply drops. They must be defended from corrupted creatures for a total of five waves, and the size of the node dictates how hard it will be to defend. If a survivor successfully fights off all of the corrupted creatures, it can harvest what the creatures haven't eaten. These nodes yield element dust, element shards, and some element. Element dust can be converted into element, and element shards can be used to power some tech equipment. The ability to craft element itself can only be learned if you're on the extinction map. So if you're on a cluster, take a second to grab that ingram. Or if you're like myself and the complete crew, you'll have to wait until you get to extinction. Of course, we all continue with the hunt to find better loot and better creatures. And there's much work ahead of us if we're going to tackle the Alpha Titan. But until next time, I'm James from Complete Games, and I'll see you.